the first lens implant to offer widescreen vision is set to transform the lives of millions of Britons suffering a debilitating eye condition. Age-related macular degeneration AMD, is the leading cause of sight loss in the over 55s. It involves the gradual deterioration of the macula, a 5 mm oval area in the center of the retina the light-sensitive cells in the back of the eyeball that enable detailed sight. The disease gradually robs people of their central vision, and about 4 million Britons have it, including 500,000 with late-stage AMD in which there are significant problems with sight. Although drug treatments can slow the disease's progress, there is no cure. Previously, implants corrected this problem by redirecting light rays to another part of the macula, but restoring the center of vision came at the expense of peripheral vision. In contrast, the new lens is curved in such a way that projects images across the entire macula, offering unparalleled all-round vision. The 10-minute procedure is suitable for those with intermediate stage and advanced AMD. And in another first, it is also suitable for those who have had a lens replacement due to cataracts, which was previously impossible. The IMAX implant was developed by surgeon Bobby Qureshi and Professor Pablo Artal, an optics expert at the University of Murcia in Spain.